was geared up. Hey, people are asking me, do you regret coming back to Kenya? My friends, why should I regret coming back to Kenya? I'm in my country, I can do whatever I want. You know one thing about Germany? One thing about Germany is like, uh, we have we, we've, we've been designed like in one particular order, like job, home, job, home. Like we are like, like uh, robots, we are controlled by the system. Yeah? <laughs> so, you can, you can never do whatever you want in Germany, but in Kenya you have a lot of freedom. Like I can go here, I can move here, I can go there, I can come back, I can do this and this. I can do whatever I want. Uh, in Germany, there are things you cannot do, like the, uh, things like you, you can do in Kenya and you can never do them in Germany. Be it family, be it your job, be it your school, be it your salary. <laughs> <laughs> they will control everything. Like you are being, con it's, it's like an open prison. German is like a, op an open prison. Like you are in prison, but you are allowed to move everywhere. Like you can go there, you can do this, you can do that, you can move here and there. Same as a marriage in German. It's like a little prison. You can do this and this. People will do this and this. The government will be on you uh, because of this and this. So it's like a, an open prison. Like you are allowed to move, uh, go there, come back home, like that. So. It's a little bit uh, difficult because if you don't follow the rules, my friends, <laughs> your life will be in danger. Hmm? If you don't follow the right rules in Germany, my friends, you are finished. Yeah. So, do I regret uh, coming back to Kenya? No, I don't regret. I've just been here for like like five months. I haven't even stayed for one year so that you can say that ah, you made a mistake coming to Kenya. Oh, we don't see you moving around. No, we are going. With in Kenya, you move according to uh, the system also, but not like in Germany. Like for me, my passport is somewhere, stuck somewhere. I'm still waiting for my passport so I can travel. So it's like, uh, it's not that necessary, but I can still travel. But without my passport, I cannot cross borders. That's why I'm stuck in Kenya, here. Yeah. <laughs> so I don't regret. I have a lot, a lot, a lot of things in store. You're going to see them. Let's say uh, at the end of this month, yeah, we start moving here and there, yeah. You're gonna see more videos, yeah. We are in Europe, we are in the UK, we are moving, yeah. So we are moving because I've told you there are some places if you want to move, you need like a UK visa or a US visa. A lot of uh, countries, especially in uh, South America, you need like a US visa or UK visa. Once you have the visas, you can move wherever you want. I don't know why. <laughs> but the good thing about uh, having like a foreign passport, you don't need visas. You just need like a 10 euro. Like you go on the internet, you key in like I'll be in, in the US for 10 days from this date and this date. And then you pay like 10 euro for their ETA. It's not a visa, but it's something that shows that we'll be in the country for like 10 days or 20 days or 30 days and then you'll we'll come back to you. You can't. But for us, it's very hard. So, do I regret again? No, 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 no. If I want, I can move back to Europe. But for now, I'm concentrating on my other stuff. Yeah, There's some things I haven't done. I want to do it. And I always think when I am in Germany, it's a little bit hard for me to accomplish what I want. Uh, compared when I'm in Kenya. Like, I can go somewhere, come back to Kenya, from Kenya, I go here, come back to Kenya. Like, I haven't been to Philippines, Thailand, it's visa-free, yeah? But you need, like, a proper timetable. Like, I can move from Thailand to Philippines, from Philippines. Like, you don't need to, uh, to come back to Kenya because my, my, my passport is a half. Like, half of it is fully stamped. And my passport is, uh, is like, 32 pages. But nowadays, I think... Hey, should I change my passport first before I uh, start moving around the world or I should just stick to my 32 page because if I was to move uh, right now by six months my passport will be full because it's already half like I've used the half pages let's say 16 pages they are done they have a lot of stamps the other 16 I don't know <laughs> so I'll be in Kenya uh, frequently just to apply for my passport and everything to re 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 renewing my passport I have to renew my passport yeah but I still have like five years before it expires but I think 
when I start traveling, after six months, I have to come back to Kenya and renew my passport to the new one. I think it's 50 pages. Very nice. Very nice. Kenyan government, kudos. Yeah. The two pages is. It's not like uh, it's too much pages because the, the first page is like the introduction, the last page is like uh, uh, the instruction and whatever, whatever. So it's good, it's good. They have extended the pages to 50 pages. It's, it's like international standard. I saw the new passport, it's good. So I have to renew my passport again, but after six months. So I have like uh, December, January. I'm, I'm starting to. Uh, Traveling, starting my, my travels in December or in January, yeah, because my passport is stuck somewhere in uh, an embassy, <laughs> so I don't regret. Yeah, I haven't started traveling like I, I, have, I, I have traveled. I don't like this job or I don't like this and this because of this and this. No, I haven't started traveling. I've been in Kenya for five months. This is six months, so I'm still good. I cannot now say that I regret or I don't regret. No, no, no. I'm good. I'm chilling. I'm taking my time. After everything is okay, you'll see me on the road. Yeah? So don't worry about me. Hmm? For you, I want you to go, to go to Germany. That's why I always scream here. Learn the language. You go to Germany and feel the vibe. Meet the new language. Meet new people. Uh, cultural, uh, cultural exchange. Have like an uh, idea on how things are run outside the country. It's raining. It's raining. I'm so happy. It was very hot. So I don't regret moving back to Kenya. And I'm okay with it. If I, uh, I regret, I'll tell you. I'll take the, the next flight back to Europe. <laughs> but it won't happen uh, anytime soon. Yeah? <laughs> it won't happen anytime soon. No, 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 it won't happen. Yeah? No, 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 it can never happen. I have to accomplish what I came back to Kenya to do. Once I accomplished everything, I moved here and there and there and there. Now... I can just relax and move to uh, Colombia. <laughs> yeah? For me, I love traveling. Traveling is like uh, something. It's like when I'm stressed, I just go like to Mombasa, to Malindi. I go to uh, somewhere, just chill. I love, especially uh, right now, I love the beach. I don't know why. I just love a nice conversation on the beach, sipping my favorite drink on the beach. That's my favorite life, yeah? If traveling was free, I'll be in Maldives. Uh, I'll be right now in uh, Thailand, just chilling, enjoying on the nice beaches, the white sandy beaches, just chilling. Mm? But you need like a system, like you need passports, you need visas, you need this and this. So I haven't yet uh, regretted moving back <laughs> to Kenya. And I don't think it will happen. <laughs> It will never happen to Fiakwa. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.